hey, you wanna play Take It or Leave It? Well, this video will get you playing as quick as possible. All right, so this is the basic look at the UI. The, the way this game always works is by clicking that on button. That on button, clicking that will send it up to your secondary screen. As soon as you turn it on, you're gonna see the intro loop and you're gonna hear some intro walk-in music. So music's included, uh, lots of fun. But I'm just gonna, for now, I'm gonna mute that just so we can talk over it. Uh, now, whenever you click the on button, right below is the screen selector. And the screen selector is really cool because it will show every display you have connected and you can put this game on any display uh, that you have connected to your computer. Now you can also, we have a thing called uh, custom fit. What custom fit will do, you can see it kind of shrunk it down. You can select whatever size and location and which screen you want the game to be played on. So if you have a, uh, you know, let's say an interesting setup, then this will allow you to put it just about anywhere that you want. But for now, uh, we're gonna click down to just screen number two. And if you click screen number two, it will automatically go to full screen on that screen. These games work best at 1280 by 720, but whatever your system settings are for that display, it will go full screen to that. So if you can set your secondary display to 1280 720, probably get the best results, easier on the graphics card. Okay, so uh, the way the game works, we've got the intro loop, which you've already seen, and then we've also got the show game button. When you click that, and it's gonna spin around, and you're gonna see the game board. So the game board's uh, really cool the way it's set up. You can see it's all represented right here. So we have a bunch of different dollar amounts. And uh, the way this game is set up, you would have 14 containers. They could be envelopes, they could be briefcases, they could be lunch boxes, whatever you want. 14 uh, containers with prizes in them. And then they will, to start the game off, they will pick one of those prizes and set on the table with them. And then they will slowly remove, uh, they will remove containers from the stage and then as they're removing them, they'll get offers, the, someone will try to buy their remaining one from them, and they can either take it or leave it. All right, see the name right there. Uh, okay, so it's real uh, easy. So if they pick one, said so we'll pick number three, and it's the number five, uh, then it's for $5, you'll just turn that off, and when you click the off button, it just animates right off. A little sound effect, a little video, really nice and easy. So you can see, you'll just continue to click these off until you're down to just your last two, then they're making the offer. Now, some people, when they're playing this, they don't want to play for money. They're playing, say you're playing at like a, um, a camp or something, or, or you're just playing with your, with your team and you're playing for points. You can set, however you're doing this, we have up to 10 different sets that you can use, and each one of those sets can either be for either dollars, points, or prizes. So set number two, we've got set two points. So now everyone's just playing for points, and you'll see it's up on there. There's no dollar signs, it's just pure points. Now. We've also got, I think I said set number three, is, is these are prizes. Now these are uh, just random things. So like the, the view at the top ones to be not so good and your best ones down here where the thousand dollars was in the original. So uh, so the bad one is getting booed off stage. So these are, these are things that don't really cost anything uh, to kind of make up and down here you can have something really good. If you're uh, working with a youth group and you get a, a camp coming up, you can give away a free camp, uh, give away TV if you want, uh, whatever you feel like filling those in. Now what's really cool is as these are, are as these prizes are, are removed, you're gonna see the offer is gonna change depending upon what they've done. So if they, uh, as they remove the, the bad ones, the, the offer will change to more of the good ones. So what that would mean is if they're right here and they've removed, you can see they've removed some of the good ones and there's a couple uh, the, right here in the middle is the t-shirt the is right about there and that's the current offer is so the when you click show offer Oh, we're getting a call from the uh, get the audio here get a little call from the uh, from the banker He's gonna offer you one t-shirt. So you have a guaranteed t-shirt we'll, we'll hand it for you right now if you swap stuff for whatever you've won So well, I don't know you are gonna take that deal or you can leave that deal so if they if they leave it then it's gonna be They get the big X and it goes away now the way that works, and that works across the board. So if you're doing, uh, if you're in set one, then it's going to be for dollars, and the the current offer will be in dollars, and that's going to average. There's an algorithm that actually averages the dollar amounts here and gives you a good offer. If you're playing for points, it'll use the same algorithm. If you're using prizes, it'll use one of these prizes closest to that. So as we remove the bad ones, I remove the the good ones. And then if there's still some bad ones left over here, you'll see this will adjust based on whatever is available. So now there's, most of the good ones are gone, so the offer is not gonna be just a fancy keychain. No, it's, I don't know how fancy it is, but it just depends on your budget.
So anyway, so that's how it all works. When it's uh, when you finally get down to, um, as you're moving, you can just keep making, you can show the offer. Oh, we get a phone call. It's, it looks like you've got an offer for um, a snow globe. So would you wanna, we can give you a snow, a guaranteed snow globe right now, or do you wanna keep uh, going forward and see if you've won that hoodie? <laughs> Whatever, that's the next best thing up there. So if they say take it, then Yahoo, big celebration. All right, you want a snow globe, great job. Thanks for playing, here's your snow globe. Have a fantastic day, and then they can go on out. Now, I will just tell you this. If, uh, when you get down to it, if, if there's no, if they decide not to, if they decide to leave it, and it gets all the way down to, uh, down to the last two, when there's just two items remaining, you're either gonna win a postcard or you're gonna win that snow globe again. You're gonna win one of those two. When they open the last one, if you see what they want, click on the other one. So if you see, oh, if they open their case and they did in fact have the snow globe, then you just click on postcard and it knows that that's what they finally wanted. It will do the big celebration that way as well. So that's how you would do it uh, when it gets down to just the final two. So it automatically does the, uh, the calculations for you. So, uh, so that's the whole game. We've got an intro loop here. Uh, the music is included, so we got some fun, uh, fun music for the intro, some dramatic music for the, when you're playing the game show. I mean, and whenever you hit the intro loop, that resets the whole game. So the whole game is reset. I can go down and select now. I'm gonna select uh, set number two. I'm at all points. Hit game show, and I'm back in. I'm ready to play again, and that music, that dramatic music, kicks in. Listened to that drama. So that is take it or leave it. Hope you have a whole lot of fun. Oh, and there's also a volume slider down here at the bottom. That affects just the volume of the music. The sound effects stay the same level. So set your levels based on the sound effects and you can adjust your music uh, from here. All right, well, that is, uh, that's Take It or Leave It. Hope you have a fun time. If you have any questions, let us know. And we'll see you next time. All right, bye.